we have Blue Eddie. Now, they are having a buyback program campaign to promote clean energy. Like, um, the benefits of having this, you can run it in case of a power outage, you can run it in your house or in your garage. No fumes, no pouring gas in it, no spillage, no exhaust, all that kind of thing. So if you have an old gas generator and you would like to replace it, take a picture. Um, if you can find a receipt, I take a picture and uh, and you're looking at buying the AC 200L, AC 300, AC 500, or bundles with solar panels or extra batteries, they're going to give you a rebate of up to $550 back. So you're gonna have savings just to help people get rid of the old, um, you know, the price is not much different. These power stations have over a 10 year lifespan killing them, recharging them, you know, if you're camping, you're RVing, or you're having one for backup power, you're just doing like I am, and I run my cabin here full-time, 100% off-grid with Blue Eddy Power. I thank them very much for the sponsor, and I'd like to help them out. I would like to help you guys out, so there's some special offers. You go to the link, and there's special offers. Um, it may vary on the type of generator you have, how old it is, that kind of thing. But they're going to give some rebates up to $550 to help you go towards a bundle package um, that can help you in the future. Uh, so along with me, this program is from April 25th to May 30th. So this buyback program um, that Blue Eddie is doing, it's really, it's called Dark to Green. Let's try and green things up, save a little where you can. I'm going to be showing you that these power stations can do a lot of different things that you can't even imagine. If you've followed me for a while, you've seen what I've used, and I'll be showing you more in the future in an upcoming video. But we'll, we might show you a little bit here in this one, different, uh, different things. So let's just go and collect some energy from the sun. I'll show you where mine is. So here we're running on the cabin. We're able to bring in 1100 watts, 1150 watts. And it's going from here down inside. I'll show you where it's hooked. Look at it. X6. groceries I need for a few days. A parcel pickup. You know who sent this. Thank you very much. Uh, and you know who sent this. Thank you very much. We are going to have a green Earth Day. Well, Let's see what we have here. It's a box. And another box. instruction book.
looks like a heavy duty cable. That, my friends, is a B300K with 2764.8 watt hour battery. And it's bastion battery for my AC300. Let's go hook it up. We got the AC300 hooked up there with the three B300K batteries. Just linked one battery to the other, that one to the other, and that one to the AC300. And um, we're at 71%. So what I'm going to do, I just took the cable up here. There's a four prong plug. This cable goes in and this cable will go to the solar panels. And it actually comes with a splitter. So you can hook two separate strings of solar panels up together just to get a little more power. So we have to 1600 watts. So we'll get it uh, plugged in and we'll see what we're getting. So we have some splitters right there, plugged into the solar panels. Four hundred seventy-six watts coming in. That sun is doing a pretty good job. So we're up to seventy-three percent. So she's charging. Well, most of you know that I run a full-size washing machine here at the cabin, all off the sunshine. When I clean the house, I use a shop vac and it pulls around 1000 watts. Vacuum everything up, get rid of the sawdust, wood chips, all that good stuff. It's not on, but it does work. I watch TV from time to time when I'm not busy showing you what I'm up to. Of course, the TV, internet, computer, all that runs off the sun. Well, hiding behind the jars. Yes, that's my water pump. All runs off the sun. And of course, my refrigerator, like anyone else has, runs off the sun. I run a freezer. Seven cubic foot. Sometimes I have a five cubic foot plugged in too. All off the sun. I have an outside plug and uh, I have a regular sump pump. It pumps my sewer out. When it decides it wants to kick in, it kicks in, pumps out. All off the sun. And we got 57 watts being used. 479 watts coming in. So, it's not too bad. Well, what do you think? Check it out. I mean, it is amazing what the technology has done nowadays and Blue Eddy is helping trying to uh, make a cleaner world. So, um, Earth Day now is just past, but this is uh, as much as possible. We try and do what we can. If we can capture the sun right there behind me on those panels and we do laundry and all that kind of stuff. And uh, you just learn to change the time of day a little bit when you're doing things, stuff like that. So we uh, have a link there guys check it out there's different bundle packages and stuff like that and the rebate so if you go on the link there there will be a spot where you can send a photo or, or uh, email um, to show and uh, have the proof 
and they will decide how much the rebate is going to be for you. So it just helps a little bit to help people make greener choices. So we hope everybody has trying to just think about different things they do since Earth Day has rolled around and we do what we can to use the sun when we can. So we thank Blue Eddie for the program and uh, we hope that this reaches people. If you know someone that can use a little help and they want to get off using generators, stuff like that, um, it's not hard. So it doesn't have to cost a lot of money. You can run a pretty small system. I do not have a big system. That's what I have behind me. That's what runs the whole cabin, everything here. And uh, I get by just fine. There's many, many things that I can use it for. And if it's too much, it'll tell me. So sometimes you do one thing at a time or just make sure you have a sunny day to do it. So I hope you guys all enjoy the video. Don't forget a thumbs up. So as I'm showing you, we're taking this in from the sun. And I might have missed. I think I said 1600 watts, but we're going to bring 1200, no more than 1200 watts coming in from the solar. It will charge at a higher rate if you're charging it uh, from a wall plug, AC. Um, so all the features that these power stations have, like um, there's so many, so many different features. Like we have the AC 300 here and it comes with uh charging cable for plugging it into your AC wall or into a generator if you have to. Comes with a splitter, uh, cable goes into here, um, cigarette lighter that uh, you can plug in to uh, car charging cables. And of course comes with a manual, very well laid out manual and stuff so that uh, you can see what everything kind of is and all the different options and things that it has. I mean, we're 24 volt 10 amp charger, cigarette lighter, 12 volt, 30 amp port, um, LCD screen. Oh, it just lights up very nice, easy touch screen to, to read. It's got the USB fast charging and it's got uh, USB A's and uh, it's got six of the US or the 120 uh, max uh, 20 amp ports and it's got a 30 amp and it has wireless charging on the top. I'll show you that in a minute. And the power button, of course, your USB-Cs, battery connection ports on the end, so you can put expansion batteries to it. Uh, your AC input cable comes with a nice big cable to plug in here, heavy duty. And uh, DC1 to DC2 input port on here as well. So different ways of charging and uh, the options that, whether you're just running a small cabin or something like that, um, you maybe don't need that much power. Uh, I am running full cabin all the time, so uh, I don't usually bring my phone in, but we have two 15 watt charging ports here on the top. Like I said, all the other ports, cables comes with, and you know that I've replaced this. Uh, I had, was running the uh, 2400 watt, 2048 amp hour, so that will be spare. Um, it runs a lot of different things. I can take it outside, do different things. This is a little heavier because this unit doesn't have a battery inside of it. It has to have batteries to go with it. So uh, the AC300, you'd be packing more. Um, this little uh, machine here, and we'll be showing you the other one in the future here. But um, I can pick it up, take it outside, and run power tools, all that kind of stuff when I'm working around the yard. Very easy, it lasts a long time, using cut off saw, grinders, all that kind of stuff. And uh, so um, it's just good to have one that you can take around with you wherever, throw it in the car, take it with you uh, on road trips or your van or RV. This one goes camping with me. So I hope that uh, can help you guys a little bit. Um, won't be any discount code uh, used other than uh, if you got a picture of your old gas generator and uh or proof of receipt um and uh i believe you'll be sending a picture of that if you uh want to get yourself a discount it could be as much as 100 or 550 dollars if you've got a bigger generator and that kind of thing you just want to promote if you're buying something a little bigger you're going to save a little more and you can use this a lot so um again thank you guys all for coming along